going on everybody the Iceman here on this Wednesday it is August 12th 2015 uh, had a great hangout last night with Nigel uh, NF Punk uh, on Google Hangouts uh, I want to thank Nigel uh, for being patient uh, with uh, you know having to re sign back on and whatnot but we talked about everything uh, under under the Sun basically uh, he's at he asked me a lot of questions um and to be quite honest would you uh, some of the questions I got caught off guard with really uh, but you know answered them as truthfully as as I could you know uh, asking me about um, you know what how long my stay is gonna be here on YouTube and whatnot and you know I, I just um, I'm trying to I don't know my head is not together that's the thing I just um, there's a lot of things going on uh, within the family which you know they're not bad things but uh, it's there's some big life-changing things that are gonna happen and I, I I'm trying to you know digest it all and 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 whatnot and uh, it's gonna be a major change uh, for myself um, but uh, yeah so I um, uh, answered everything as much as possible. I even talked about uh, the past here on YouTube and you know how much of a jerk I used to be um, when I drank. And uh, but and a lot of times uh, I was a jerk because I had to respond to things that went on that a lot of people just didn't understand. And uh, uh, but you know that's what it was back then. You know. You didn't, you, you don't let anybody get the better of you. And I didn't, you know, I tried not to anyway. But, uh, yeah, we talked about John Cena. We talked about CM Punk, uh, him being a CM Punk fan, me being the John Cena fan that I am. Um, you know, uh, the WWE definitely misses CM Punk without a doubt. I mean, uh, I'm hoping the WWE can, you know, get their... They're booking back in gear. Um, I like the new John Cena shirt that came out, 15 times world champ. Uh, I honestly think this has come out at a particular point in time where it obviously is out here for a reason. Uh, a lot of people are, are thinking Cena is going to get the belt from Rollins at SummerSlam. And I thought that as well myself, but I'm thinking it's not the main event. It's going to be, you know, as far as I know right now, it's going to be Lesnar and Undertaker. So that's going to be the main event. And um, so, I, I mean, if this is title versus title and it's not a main event, it makes you wonder uh, whether or not the uh, titles will change hands. I, I'm still looking for a disqualification in this match. Um, and I think if anything... Uh, I think Night of Champions, because I don't believe Lesnar and Undertaker will be around at Night of Champions. I think, if anything, uh, Cena and Rollins, if a title is going to change, it would be at Night of Champions. Uh, I don't know. That's just my opinion. Uh, I, I do believe that John Cena will get the 16th title reign somewhere. Uh, I just, you know, I just don't exactly know when. So, uh, yeah, it's, it's going to be interesting uh, to wait and see what really does develop here in the WWE. And, and hopefully, uh, like I said, the booking in the WWE, they need to, you know, do some big things. Uh, somebody asked me about my thoughts with um, Stephen Amell uh, joining forces with Neville to go up against Barrett and Stardust at SummerSlam. I, you know... Honestly, I, you know, I, I never was into the big celebrity involvement within matches in the in the WWE. I know they've done it throughout the years. Uh, they did it from the very first uh, WrestleMania uh, back in '85, and you know, I just, I don't know, I, I, I'm not too keen on that. But uh, you know, it, it's a four-hour show, so they got to come up with something to beef it up. Uh, Matt and I were talking earlier today. We were talking about. You know, the card, it's not quite obviously set yet. 
But I, you know, like I told him, I go, Cena and Rollins, the title doesn't change there. You can bet it's SummerSlam. Uh, you can bet one of the other titles are going to change hands, uh, whether it be the Intercontinental title, whether it be a Divas title, or whether it be the WWE Tag Team titles. There will be title changes at SummerSlam because making it a four-hour event, um, something something big has got to happen. Um, I I almost I, I I see Kane returning too. Uh, maybe Kane, maybe Kane gets involved in the the WWE title match, which causes a disqualification. But I have noticed that Sheamus has been, you know, really brought up a lot lately. So it's possible that Sheamus will as well. We'll just have to wait and see. Um, I, I, I really don't know, but I'm, I'm looking forward to it. Um, four hours pay-per-view is really tough to watch. Uh, you know, it is, but, you know, you try to get through it. And uh, because if it's if the matches aren't uh, well set up and um, and whatnot, uh, it could be a very very long four or four hours. Because we all know uh, uh, what it's like to watch a three hour raw when when it just doesn't seem to deliver. But again, you know we'll just have to wait and see. I'm going to go into it like I always say. Lately, I go into it to watch it as a fan and I'll critique it. After it's all said and done, but I'm not going to go in there uh, watching it to critique it as I'm watching it. I wait till it's all said and done. I let it sit in. I give myself a day to really let it digest and let it sink in to my mind. And then I go from there. So anyway, again, I want to thank Nigel for the hangout last night. Um, I hope everybody has a great Wednesday. Uh, you know, I was to go out to my sisters this week. I, I, I know I mentioned that before. Uh, but my buddy's car is in the in the garage and 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 whatnot and uh, so I probably won't get out there till you know probably for a couple weeks so it's unfortunate uh, I enjoy it when I go out there so anyway uh, peace out everybody enjoy the rest of your Wednesday uh, we'll see you down the road uh, obviously with another video uh, because. Obviously, with this video, I'm still here um, for however however long. I'm just trying to get the passion back uh, making videos. It's And I, I'm not blaming it on any of uh, wrestling in general. It just, I've lost something, and I just, I'm trying to get it back. I don't want to make a quick decision and then regret it. So, we'll just see what develops. So, peace out, everybody. We'll see you all next time. The one and only Iceman.